Hey everyone, in today's Instagram video, I wanted to show you how to add a lot more effects than the one that you see here created by Instagram to your Instagram story camera. So a lot of people don't know that the effects that you see here are just a few available that you could add and customize here. And if it's your first time here, I make easy to follow Instagram and social media videos every single day. So please consider subscribing. So let me start here on the homepage of Instagram and we're just gonna slide here to the left to get to our Instagram story camera. And on camera, I'm on normal mode. You could also be on boomerang mode and get the same effects. But on normal mode, if you just go here to the right of the camera, you'll have a bunch of effects that you could choose. And some require a face and some do not. I'm just doing it here on this Rubik's Cube. But there is a lot more effects than the ones you see here. And you could actually remove and reorganize these. So let me go all the way to the side here and you'll see browse effects. If you press this option, it will bring you to the effects gallery that most people that I've talked to haven't seen at all. They didn't know this was part of Instagram story camera. And here you could go to the ones from Instagram if you tap the Instagram option and that shows you the ones that Instagram created and there's a lot of options here that you could choose from or you could look at some of the other ones that Instagram did not create under camera styles for example. And let's say you wanted this unpixelated one, it's going to tell you who created it as well on top and you could just press try it. And as you could see by trying it, it's added it here to my filters. On the bottom of each filter too, when you see someone's name, you could press that and you could save the effect or you could press more to remove the effect. Let me show you what save effect does. If I press save here. So now if I go back to the homepage here, the save effect is on the left of the homepage instead of scrolling all the way to look for something. So if I wanted to add, let's say another one here, I could press halo on the bottom text, save effect. And now go over here and you could see next to my home on the left, there are the two that I saved. And anytime I could press the text on the bottom and I could press more and I could press remove and that will just remove it from all my effects here. I could at any time go back here and then go to browse effects or the tab all the way on the bottom, all the way to the right. And then I could view the effect, click on one and then go ahead and try it or press the download one that says save to favorite and that will save it to my camera. So now if I exit out of here, it will be right here on the left of my home option. And as you can see, some have different options on top as well. So it's not just the one that you see by default. There are some other options like in this one is creating grainy effects on top of your image. And then you could just press it to take the picture. And it's that simple to add other effects to your camera on Instagram that you don't see by default. I hope you found this video useful. Please give it a thumbs up and subscribe for easy to follow social media videos. And I'll catch you next time. Thanks for watching.